you'll see that we got LK9 T9, which is his official model, right? right. All right, so we'll go on into here. And who do we want to beat up? Sub-Zero, yeah, Absolutely, surely. we always right. beat up Sub-Zero. Right. Right. It right. only makes sense, totally right? fair. All right, and I'm sure everybody wants to see the pit. So let's go ahead and do the pit as well. The pit is making a comeback into MKXL. And it's beautiful. It looks incredible as well, like we'll just visually as a stage. <sighs> We're doing. Pra we're getting some Wait, yelling from yeah, people in the background. I'm sorry. We are. Uh, we're doing practice mode for now, but the, the the twins are gonna play here in a little bit against uh, each other. Look, we disappointed so many people. You'll, You'll get your intros later. You'll get your intros and more. Wow. Don't worry. Don't All worry. right. So his back dash is a sweet little flippy thing here, right? Um, now, we've got Sector, so he's got all your base Sector moves, plus they're a little bit enhanced because we got to mix it up some. Yeah, like, like in most of our combat casts, we'll always show, like, what special moves that the characters share. Now, because these are all, you know, the different robots, right. they don't share any special moves. No, they really do not share, they share zero special moves. So, coming back is the straight missile, right? Now we can EX it, and it does this super four missile magma craziness right there. And he's got his back rockets. But you can actually direct them in different distances. So you can put it behind the opponent, or of course you can put it in front of the opponent or directly on them. So you guys would see almost immediately that um, the projectile side of Sector is very much how it used to be. He had the straight missile, he has the up missile. What happens if you meter burn the up missile, Derek? Oh, the up missile, you say? Let me go ahead and do it. And there it is. Homing missiles, boys, it's come back. Also does chip damage now, which something didn't used to do. Okay. Um, of course, he's got his telepunch coming right back, and you can EX it if I could press the right trigger, and that'll bounce it for you to do a follow-up attack. If I could do that, but you know, I'm not professional. Can I, let me let me just give a little option select for you real quickly. Absolutely. Uh, we are playing on a larger TV, which has a little bit of uh, a little bit of lag, so the combos are going to be a little. Uh, so hard. we might drop combos. <laughs> Our excuses are already good to go. Right. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. absolutely. Absolutely. So, like we said, he's got his telepunch coming back. Ex. Ex. Telepunch coming back, and of course, you can follow up with another combo. Right. Um, and then what's special to uh, MKX is he's got this sweet air dash now, right? Like, check it out! Can only be done airborne, I would like to add. Right. Only while he's in the air. Um, and so one thing that you'll notice with each one of these variations is they have a lot of common combos, but they also have a lot of variation-specific combos as well. So and the, um, the team did a really good job too of giving the the specials, I mean the, the strings they have, their own personality. Absolutely. So uh, he's got this one combo that he has this chest burst that comes out. That's only exclusive to Sector. He did actually have that string in Mortal Kombat 9 as well. Just to remind before we had uh, one final move as well, his flame burner, the down oh, down Oh, of eight. course. The, how could I forget? That's why we have you here. Mm -hmm. And so, of course, that is coming back. It Booyah. doesn't restand anymore. Sorry, no, guys. No, it does not. Um, PPJ thought the same thing. So, uh, so you can do the EX one, and I could do it. Look at that. So you could use that as like an anti-air. You can it's use it just quick get away. One good thing about that move too is it's uh, it's armored. Exactly that. The, the uh, meter burn flame burner has got armor and hits multiple times, so it does armor break. Uh, so it functions really well. Basically, just as a get off me tool that Sector always lacked in Mortal Kombat 9, but he has got an X. Cool. And so, uh, and he has these reaching like blasters on his hands too, which uh, I believe he also had back in MK9. That looks like his old back one, Derek. I but do. Can you, I do. Uh, can you special cancel that? I can. I can try. We'll see. Oh gosh, I I'll let you do that. You you're the professionals. Uh, yeah, this is not working for him. We'll do that one later. Yeah, yep. and then of course, even on just his low, you see he's got a little blaster as well. So it gives him that little extra reach as well. Um, so I'm gonna let you do some swaggy combos. You want to do it? Why not? All right. See see what you can pull off here. Okay. So it see the pressure is real. Bam! Into up rocket, just like Vintage so, MK9. His combos are, are virtually very, very similar. You have the starter, which goes into teleport, combo into meter event teleport, and then follow up with whatever you want. You can do damage, but it's quite nice to do an up missile. It allows you to get pressure. Obviously, you can combine that with your zoning, which will be keep away. This starts up really, really quickly. So, uh, and another cool thing. So you'd uh, say he's uh, pretty strong in zoning. Yes, exactly. A little so bit. When you break it down, Sector was always a very strong space control character. But the fact that it starts up quicker now, you can control where the missiles go. They hit multiple times, which will serve armor breaking purposes. It's going to eat that armor.
Right, and right. it will hit multiple times. But the cool thing about his teleport is, by itself, I want you to pay attention to the speed. Instant Air Boys returns. So the the, when you meet your burn, the teleport starts up way quicker. And that allows you to follow up for another thing. Go in for your homing missile, whatever you want to do. And then you've got all kinds of strings and can take confirm into other things. Don't show it all off. Don't going. give it all to him, wow. all, right? all right? All right. That was good. All right. I'll that was down. good. I'll come down. All right. So, um, oh. I can't hear you. Um, so we're gonna just gonna head and go into Cyrax. All right. So you. Wait. Let's do. Let's do it. Let's do an X-ray real quick. Oh, absolutely. You're yep. right. One thing that is also with each variation, they have their own into for the X-ray. So Sector has his more traditional MK9. So does Cyrax. And Smoke is kind of like a hybrid. So we'll get into that too. Nice. Oh, and people once love again. throws too, right? That's yeah. pretty much exactly the same as this Mortal Kombat 9 X-ray, a giant missile. Exactly that throw isn't though, yeah. is it? Yeah. That throw nah, is very different. All right, I know you're excited, so let's go ahead and get into Cyrax. You ready? Absolutely. All right, here we go. Practice options. I like to sing through pretty much anything. Yeah, let's give you know mm -hmm. Sub Zero a different one. It has to be Sub Zero at every time. All times. Every time. When they we showed off the uh, new pit fatality, Sub Zero. Sub -Zero. All right, so you'll notice right off the bat he's yellow. All yep. right, so that's a really good show of which variation we're in. Um, coming back, of course, are his bombs. Now, go ahead and break their hearts. Now, they're low now, guys. They are no longer unblockable. Um, one thing definitely worth mentioning, in MK9, he did have some crazy damage possibilities through the unblockable bombs. They are now lows, so hopefully, uh, especially with what we've found so far, there doesn't seem to be the scope of quite the same level of uh, damage you can get before, so hopefully... Don't mind me, guys. Just turn it off for release check. That Sorry, could be I should have done this before. Gosh, I'm horrible. Wasn't a problem for me, Derek. Uh, oh, Stop okay. it! Gosh. All right, so he's got his ground bombs coming back. You can do a, a mid one. You can shoot one far away from your opponent, or you can put one right in front of you. Again, just like MK9. Just like MK9. Um, what you also can do is the EX version, which will... Uh, there we go, which will detonate instantly. So otherwise, they kind of have to time out, right? And you got to have that uh, proper time. But you'll, you'll, you'll find those setups pretty quickly. It's just Abs to get that, that standard launching capability, really. Yeah. Absolutely. And, of course, his buzzsaw is back. Grind, grind, grind. Again, a mid now. Used to be an overhead. Uh-huh. And you can EX it, if I can do it. And it'll actually hold the opponent in the air for a little bit as well. Um, He's got his teleport, or he's got his air grab, which you can do in the air and just kind of get away or get towards your opponent. Uh, do it off the ground. He's got his teleport, and he's got his EX teleport. I like how you showed the air grab without ever air grabbing. Though. Oh, yeah, my bad. Here we go. Booyah! There we go. So as long as the opponent's in an airborne state, that will combo as it used to. And, and combo. you can do And you can do the EX one, which will do an uh, additional bounce to continue your combos. Right? Like with that net And that brings onto the net. Right. And everybody was so happy when they saw the net coming back. So, to answer the questions, what does the EX net do? It drains bar from the opponent. Once again, it's back. All right. Drains well, it drains half, half, a, yeah, yep. half a bar now. It used to drain a full bar, but now drains half. So yep. you basically spend a bar to get rid of half of theirs. And so what and we... And trap them. Right. And so what's new with Cyrax is he's also got some air bombs. So it's not... It, he just doesn't cover the ground. He also covers the air. So you can set up all sorts of different little tricks. But that's it, right? Like, the, obviously, the ground bombs being low, they're mids. Like, they're just standard blocks, the air ones, but they cover uh, more practical ground, obviously, in the air. They can't really jump in at you as much. Um, but it's just to really set out that minefield. It will be quite interesting moving into uh, Cyrix and Chaos. Right. And so, um, just like the ground bombs, if you set them up, they instantly detonate. Otherwise, you kind of just have to, you know, wait for it to, uh, for the timeout. So, if you're playing with uh, Cyrex, what, what is your sort of game plan? Well, I mean, it is very early to tell, but right. again, much like Sector, it is very traditional Mortal Kombat 9. You know, the bombs are going to be a problem for people to deal with. On hit, they launch, so again, you know, your net being a massive projectile, again, is going to be quite difficult for people to get around. Right. Teleporting makes you really mobile. Um, so just general, I mean, especially if, if it turns out he's got some really good normals, some really good strings, then uh, I'm definitely thinking you can play him um, the way we used to. Right. And he has, he actually does have some uh, strings of his own as well, we can show. Right. So, just like how Sector had his uh, one combo with the chest that uh, would have an explosion. He shoots out a bomb out of his chest. He also has some specific buzzsaw combos as well. Uh, there we go. Similar to what he had in MK9. And let's see if I can do it. 
he's got his back too, which everybody I'm sure was waiting to know if that came back. It was very nice to use that again. Right. So uh, for the most part, that's Cyrax, but it wouldn't be fair unless you got to show some stuff off. Thank you very much. Now, he's been practicing this quite religiously, so hopefully he can get now, it. Now, the thing is, right, this is what I consider a standard MK9 Cyrax. So string into bomb, and JP. Oh, oh, my oh, 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 my word. And he's a professional. Commentator now, mate. Uh, yeah, all right, right, right. I apologize. So as you can see, it's just a mixture of comboing off the bomb yeah. and now, continuing the juggle. They're definitely what you would sort of do in MK9, but this isn't MK9. So let's see if I can maybe do this. Smart bomb. Oh, you like that one? And it goes on even longer, too. <laughs> oh, it does. Now, the thing is, one thing, just keep this in mind. I'm ending it in the grab. That grab can be meter burned to another launcher, or even, like, let's just say I get a standard um, hit on the ground, pop you up, bomb, overhead. And that bomb's a low, so that's overhead low yeah, right exactly. there. That's right. So basically, instead of ending with a standard special, end in a bomb, and then, like, do your thing and maybe try and get some kind of, you know, follow up from there. Right. right. So don't show it all off. You guys will have your moment. Yep. All right, so take this on back. Let's get into smoke. Yep. Woo! We, we got some big smoke smoke fans here. Smoke fans in the house. We have a yeah. lot of smoke there fans in the crowd, it seems. All right. All right. All right. I don't know what he said, but it sounded good. We'll, we'll change up Sub-Zero again. Sure, sure, that makes sense. Yeah, absolutely. <coughs> All three variations of Sub-Zero can't seem to catch a break. No. Oh. <laughs> All right, so here we go. We got smoke coming back. Now, this robot smoke is kind of like a hybrid of the human smoke and the classic ultimate MK3 smoke. All right, so, all right. So we've got his spears. It is three tridents that come out. Oh gosh, I just want to start playing. Uh, three tridents that come out of his chest. Now you can EX it and it'll keep your opponent standing. So you can just kind of follow up with whatever you'd like at that point. Um, in MK9, he had these smoke bombs. And of course those are coming back as well. You can change the distance, you can make it come in close, you can make it go behind them, or you can make them track by just doing the traditional one. Right. Um, he's got his air throw coming back as well, and then he has his teleport. That, that was the EX one, I'm showing too much, I'm sorry. His normal one will just do the straight knockdown. I don't think a single Vera one, I would argue it's too much. It's too much. <laughs> if anything, not enough. <laughs> and so the EX one will pop them back up. You can spear and you can continue to combo. But um, well, you might be able to. Yeah, well, in the, in the not crowd. me. Yeah, not right. me. And another thing that comes back is his ability to phase through the opponent. Now, one thing definitely to take note of in MK9, you could definitely do that a lot. I don't want to say freely, but it was very hard to deal with. It now takes your stamina to perform. Right. Does the smoke away and smoke towards. Cool. So, yep, as you watch, see the stamina meter grows down, right? And of course, you can EX them. But, one more, are you ready? He can disappear. Couldn't he do that in MK9? Could he do that in MK9? Couldn't he do that in Mortal Kombat 9? I'm pretty sure he could. I, I'm pretty sure he could. He and then in MK3 he... as well, couldn't he? Yes, he absolutely could. It's almost like he's oh, always Okay, okay that. let's stop walking down memory lane, guys, <laughs> all right? Okay, so he can go completely invisible as well. Now, what's special about Smoke is he has a few more exclusive strings than some of the other characters. Th things that might look familiar. Um, things that might look familiar. So if you do one of these, one of his combos, it'll actually throw a smoke bomb down. From there, you can actually just follow up with the spear. You can follow up with the teleport. You can do a sweep. You can, you can do a mix up. Yep. You can do an overhead, whatever you want from there. He also has this, which is very similar to his teleport. If I could do it, uh, his teleport in MK9. Yep, I'm, I'm getting there. I swear I will. But you can see the idea, really. It's yep. just, you know, that these moves are back. He's clearly got these, like, universal things and a few of the tribal normals, but he's also got his own uh, smoke effects, mix-ups, crazy teleport ninja stuff. Right. Right. Um, and for the most part, that's it. But he has a couple other, like, special things, like his neutral jumps and stuff like that have this extra smoke burst to it that gives him additional reach. Um, and there's a few other little combo tweaks as well that you can do. But that's pretty much smoke. Uh, I do think the audience did want to see some intros. 
Absolutely. So I think the best way to do that was for you guys to go to battle. I, I think a two out of three out of the classic condiment brothers are we, are would we be going, great. Are we going to have the first Cyrex Sector set of Mortal Kombat X? I Ketchup. think we are going to have... Okay, so if you already own Mortal Kombat X and you own the Combat Pack 1, you can get the Combat Pack 2 for $20, and it will include downloadable characters for the Combat Pack 2, which are Triborg, Leatherface, Alien, and...